Hello, everybody. So in today's video, we are going to be going through my entire Frozen Funko collection. And that is Frozen 2 and Olaf's Frozen Adventure. Um, I don't have any Frozen 1 Funkos. Um, I did have some. I ended up getting rid of some a year, two years ago. Um, I think I had young Anna and young Elsa. And I had Anna as an adult um, in, from Frozen 1. But I ended up getting rid of them. They're also super cheap on um, Amazon. So if I ever wanted to get them back, I could. Um, I just haven't. But um, I wanted to go through with y'all and show off my biggest Fungo collection, which is Frozen 2 and Frozen in general. Um, my second biggest Funko collection, which will probably be coming out soon, I'll probably do another video for November, um, is my Toy Story and Toy Story 4 collection. So um, I may possibly do another one of these. Let me know in the comments down below if you wanna see more of my collections and like per movie. Um, and then maybe after we get done doing a couple of those, I may build up the courage enough to do a whole entire Funko Pop collection. Um, so. You'll have to let me know in the comments down below if y'all want to see that. Um, and then let me know if there's any movies that you want to see that I may have that we can show off collections for. Um, my biggest so far are Frozen and Toy Story. And then maybe I could do a villains one. Maybe I can show off all my villains. I don't know. Let me know. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show off my um, all my Funkos. I'm going to show off the little ones first. And then I'm going to show off my big ones. Um, and I'm going to start with Frozen, our Olaf's Frozen Adventure, and then I'm going to get to Frozen 2, and then I'll show off the big ones. So, my first one is Olaf from Olaf's Frozen Adventure, and it is Olaf with Kittens. Um, my brother got this for me for Christmas. It is so cute. It is part of the short film that came out before Coco, um, and it's uh, sewing kittens for mittens, or sewing mittens for kittens. So, um, that one is super cute. That will never leave my, my house because it is a present for my brother, and I didn't even know it existed at the time when he got it for me. So I'm like, I need it and I wanted it. Uh, when he got it for me, I was so excited that he did. So, Frozen 2. We're gonna show off Elsa first, and then we'll show off Anna, and then we'll show off the rest of the characters and the big ones. Um, I have, I'm not exactly sure. I think I only have like eight or nine of each. So let's show off first Elsa. This is Elsa and this is a UK or a, I wanna say an Asian, exclusive it is elsa and it is an em emp exclusive special edition limited edition pop um and it is her in her um outfit that she wears um i think unless you're playing charades i'm not 100 percent sure um uh, i got this in a box swap um the person that i swapped with from was from denmark and she actually purchased it from the uk and sent it to me and i at the time did not know that was even actually an elsa exclusive and when she sent it to me, I was like, oh my god. I think that actually completed my Elsas. Now I have the Walmart exclusive Elsa. And this is the Elsa um, that she is dressed when she does her um, beach stuff. When she's like running on the beach and like fighting the waves. And then starts to wipe, uh, fight the water donk. Um, that one is actually really, really cool. She has her ponytail that she puts up. This is another one of her in her purple dress, the same one as earlier, but it's a Hot Topic exclusive. I don't know what the difference is, um, but it's a Hot Topic exclusive, so I had to have it. This is her from when she's in the woods, the Enchanted Woods, and she's actually holding Bruni and feeding him a snowflake. And it's also a Target exclusive. So as you can see right there, that is her holding Bruni and feeding him a snowflake. It's so cute which I did not want to take out all of these Funkos out of their boxes and then have to put them back in the box because that is just um, a lot of work. So I just went ahead and left them in their boxes. So you can unfortunately bear with me. Um, no hashtags free the pop. So um, this is another one of her in her blue dress when she goes to, I'm pretty sure this is when they're in their chain of woods as well, but this is just a regular Funko. This is nothing, no special, no limited edition, no exclusive. It's just her. Um, I'm pretty sure I got this one from Walmart with the other, the Walmart exclusive that I picked up as well. Really pretty. 
And then we have Young Elsa. Nothing, no, no spe no spe nothing special about this one either. It's just the Young Elsa. Um, I also have the Young Anna, which I'll show in a minute. Really cool, really pretty. And then we're gonna show this Elsa, which this is the Elsa, okay, so this is a purple dress. This is the Elsa from when they're playing charades and then um, Into the Unknown comes on when she's like sleeping and stuff. Cause she actually has like the diamond right there. And this is the Amazon exclusive. This one was $11.99. I think this is the most expensive one that I purchased out of the little ones. Um, but this is the Amazon exclusive. Uh, and then this is her and her purple dress with the little diamond, as you can see there. So all of these have, I think different hairstyles if I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, which is kind of cool. And then the last Elsa that I have is her in her dress at the very end of the movie. This is the dress she wears when she's singing Show Yourself, like at the end when she becomes, um, at the like the very end when she puts it all together. This is the one that has like all of like the, the jewels and stuff on it. It's actually a really pretty dress. I love this one. Um, this is, this was released in the second wave because if you haven't, if you didn't know this or not, so there is, I'll just show you this. I'll show you an example. There's wave one and there's wave two. So this is wave one, this is wave two. So there was four that came out from wave two, there's 10 that came out with wave one. Um, there's actually six that came out with wave two, um, which I'll show you those at the end. But this is the, I ordered all of the one of wave one. I picked them all out, picked them all out one by one. And then what, the wave two was announced and I was like, ugh, I just got through by wave one. And then they announced that there was gonna be like, eight different Elsas and eight different Annas, and I was like, oh God. Okay, well, let's, let's do this. So I ended up getting all of them. Um, so let's do Annas. So this is the first Anna that I picked up. Um, this is Anna from when they first start to go into the woods in her purple dress. Um, this is her, I think this is the outfit she sings her song, the Do the Next Right Thing, if I'm not mistaken. And then she also has this dress on a lot in the, in the, that sequence. Um, I also have Young Anna, nothing special about Young Anna, like the box or anything, it's not a special edition. Um, just really pretty, really cute. I loved that part in the movie when they were Do the Magic, love that part. Um, this is, this is, okay, so this is the dress that they use for Do the Next Right Thing. Um, it's actually the same dress, if I'm not mistaken. No. Yeah, it's the same dress, they just took the purple cloak off. Um, this is a Cinemark, it's a movie theater exclusive, you, ha you can only get it in the movie theater. Um, and it's her dress that she wears when she sings Do the Next Right Thing. And then let's see, we have this one. This is Anna, this is a Funko Shop exclusive limited edition. And this is Anna from the very beginning of the movie when there's, when um, she's laying on the, the blanket with Olaf singing that song, Some Things Never Change. Um, this is her from that. Really, really pretty. I, um, that one was actually on sale. I think it was like $10 instead of 15 on the Funko Shop. So I picked it up immediately. Um, this is the hardest one that I came across. This is the hardest one I to find that I, I came across. Um, it is Anna where they're doing their charades when she's in her pajamas, but it's a Michaels store exclusive. And I had the hardest time finding this because we only have two Michaels here and they both were out every time I went to get them. And then finally, the last time I went to get to look for it, they actually had it. So it also was, th I think this is the most expensive one that I purchased. I think it was like $15.99. For some reason, Michael's is also super expensive. So I um, had to pick it up because I had to have all of them. I had to have all the Anna exclusives. So I went ahead and picked it up. This is the last Anna one that I have. And it is Anna from Coronation, her Coronation dress when she became queen. And it actually has her ring on there and her crown. Let me do it this way. There's a crown. And it's just really pretty. I love this dress. I have yet to meet Anna and Elsa in these outfits. I had a chance um, last time I was at Epcot because they were outside. Um, not, I can't meet and greet with them, but they were outside. You can say hi and take pictures like a selfie and stuff. Um, so one day, one day I will meet them with those outfits. Okay, so we already did an Olaf. So let's just go ahead and do our Olaf. We have three new, we have three more Olafs that we can go through. Um, this is just a regular Olaf. This is from wave one. 
Nothing. Oh, yeah, this one has snowflakes on them. This one has, I don't know if you're going to be able to see the snowflakes. There they are. He has snowflakes on him. Really, really cute. And then this one is uh, Olaf with Bruni. This one's from the second wave. And this one has Olaf with Bruni on his head. Um, I'll show you that way. There he is. See him up there? See him up there by his little, his little um, sticks on his head? And then Olaf has a lot of snowflakes this one. You can really see the snowflakes on that one. And then we have my diamond edition Amazon or Barnes and Noble exclusive Olaf. Everything's diamond, his carrot, his sticks, his arms, his rocks, his body. Just really, really pretty. I actually got this one for $5 instead of $14.99. Or $14 so there's $14.99. I actually got it for $5 because they were having a sale where um, they were $5 a piece. Any Funko $14.99 or $15 and below was $5. And I, I went ham. I bought a bunch. So, the last three of the small ones I'm going to show off are from Wave 2. Oh, no, I have four. I have four more to show. So, from Wave 2, we have Bruni, the fire spirit. Really, really cute. Love him. His flames are on his back. You can see the flames there. They're really pink. Really, really cute. Then we have Kristoff. Reindeer are better than people. Then... Don't you think I'm right? He's so cute. Love this one. Had to have Kristoff because he's part of the collection. And we have his best friend, Sven. Love me some Sven. He's so stinking cute. He has a little, like, um, hourglass down there. He's so cute. And then the Earth Giant. This thing weighs about 25 pounds. Like, no joke. It is so heavy. He's also not almost, almost too big to be in the box. Um, and then I have one more. Here he is. Forgot to take him off. Forgot to take him off. So there is Mateus. That is the last part. That is the last one of the Frozen 2 collection. Which I'm glad they made him a Funko as well. Because um, he's a huge part of the movie. Now. Here are the big ones. These are the last three that I have to show. And these are the three biggest ones that I have to show. I'm going to show this one first because it's the first one I got. And then I'm going to show the second and the third one. This is the water knock. He is so pretty. You can look at his eyes. Look at his eyes. Sorry, the box is kind of scratched up. So pretty. Love this one. I actually got this one for $10 from BoxLunch.com. They had a sale. And I have a dollar shipping on Box Lunch, so I was able to get him for like eleven dollars, which he was retailing for, I think it was twenty eight. So to grab him, so to grab him for ten dollars was really really good. And then I got the frozen version of it, which is the frozen water knock, and this is a Box Lunch exclusive as well. And this is, if you can tell, it's whiter. It's like whiter. And it's uh, snowier looking. And this is when Elsa freezes the water knock to run on the water. Um, and its mane is actually the best part. I'll take this one out so you can see the mane. The mane. Like, look at that. That's so pretty. And on its, on its head. I just love this one. This one has never been out of box. And it probably will never be out of the plastic because it's just too pretty. And then my last and final Funko Pop of the Funko Frozen 2 collection is Elsa riding the water knock when she first like controls it and then rides on it to um, the island, the Frozen Island. This is that one. And this one I got from Amazon for, or eBay for like $27 and it was like $30 regular. Um, so I was like, I don't want to spend this money on Funko. But I have to have it because it's the final Funko I got for the Frozen 2 collection. I love it so much. And it is the final one that I got from the Wave 2 because they released those four. And then they released the Water Knox, the Frozen Water Knox, and then this one with that wave. So I am super happy to have all those. 
I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed going through all my Frozen 2 and Frozen uh, Funkos. If you like these types of videos, make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you hit the notification bell so you can notify when I upload new videos. And as always, please make, the, make sure you hit the subscribe button. We are so close to hitting 1,000 subscribers. We are, I want to say like 15 away. So if you have not subscribed, make sure you please subscribe to the channel. I would so appreciate it. And with that being said, thank you so much for being here and let's go to Disney.